Hi guys, welcome back to our Moro Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. Uh, I have here Nick Hurley, he's one of my MMA fighters as well as one of my purple belts. Uh, today I wanted to go over a really cool technique based upon someone getting double underhooks on you when you're on your back, maybe from open guard or yes, has position zero. And we're gonna transition to a really cool triangle. All right, so let's look at this. So uh, whatever the case has been, maybe I've opened my guard up and Nick's got double underhooks. All right, the first thing I'm worried about is the fact that Nick's hands are together. I need to open them up. So whatever hand is on top, in this case his right arm, I'm gonna use a monkey grip and come across and grab the meat of his hand underneath Nick's thumb. My right hand is gonna control Nick's wrist on the opposite arm, and I'm gonna to start to peel his hand off as I bring my legs open. This is called heavy leg technique. All right, I wanna really try and drive my heels down to the ground and it will aid me on pulling his hands apart. All right, now if Nick tries to start stacking me to try and get control or starts driving towards me, I'm gonna dig my head in and actually walk my head back. So I don't wanna have my legs come over my head. What I'm trying to find is a little spot that I can stick my hand through. So in this case, I'm gonna bruise my left hand and I'm gonna see if I can see the light under his armpit. So I start beating my hand through then I turn my palm up to face me. I let go of the other hand and I connect my hands palm to palm. Now the hand that's going through the armpit, I want it palm facing away from me with my gable grip. Then I kind of go to my side a little bit and I pull my elbow down. I'm not gonna slide my left leg down Nick's forearm and then start to pull, which will then allow me to get to what's called triangle position. Now notice my leg crossing. <coughs> My left leg is actually on the bottom because I'm controlling more of Nick's back with my right leg over his shoulder with my legs crossed. Now I have multiple ways to submit Nick because of the position of his arm. One which I could do an arm crush by angling his elbow to the ceiling and coming down on the arm. Or I can feed the arm all the way across, grab my shin and square myself out to a standard triangle position. All right, let's go again. So, I've opened up my guard, I've made a mistake, his hands are connected. As I'm doing heavy legs, I'm grabbing the meat of the hand, pulling it apart, feed my hand in, connect. Elbow comes down, I go to my side. My right leg's up on his shoulder, I pull down. Right now, I wanna make sure I cross my legs in the correct manner. Look for arm crush, or if the hand comes all the way through, finish off with the triangle. One more time at speed. All right guys, so hope that technique helps you guys out. I've used it quite a bit, and uh, it's really good based upon counting that double underhooks. You guys keep on staying tuned to the, uh, to the website, to the channel. I really appreciate all the comments, and uh, please rate and comment. It really helps me out. All right guys, thanks Nikki, I appreciate it buddy, and uh, I'll talk to you guys soon.